Hello family, welcome all and thank you so much for stopping by and for coming back. May God bless you all. I don't take you for granted and if it's your first time you have come uh, along this channel, please uh, feel at home and you are highly welcome. And after you finish this video or when you right now, you can just click the red button and uh, subscribe and join the family and you will be notified with others who have already joined the, the family and you will be blessed in this channel because you have to learn something in our channel we do a lot of motivational videos you know something we can learn from each other so and i know that you'll be blessed too so for my subscribers god bless you for always coming back i don't take you for granted <laughs> Uh, so today's video uh, is the part two of the uh, video that I made for uh, stuff that I buy for spices and now today is the process of making these spices so I've prepared uh, I showed you the one I prepared all uh, the stuffs and, and I washed them and now here I'm cutting some of them I'm finishing up and also some of them are ready so i uh, hope you enjoy the video and watch until the end and i know that you learn something so here all my vegetables i'll start putting them into my breader and it's good if you have a food processor i think it can be easier or a mini choppers that can chop your you know vegetables and also make them easier than if you put them into your blender i don't have the mini chopper but if uh um god will i buy one and it will be making uh, my stuff easier so that when i'm putting them to bread they are a little bit uh you know easier to blend so here uh, i'll take a long time because i'll just go slowly slowly then something else is make sure that the stuff that you are starting to blend are very soft like here garlic is so soft and the leaves the vegetables leaves so they will make it easier to blend and the ginger it has strings so i, I make sure that my ginger is well well and as chopped small small so that it don't you know make my bread to stop sometimes if you put uh, a lot of ginger it can make your bread to stop because of those small strings so yeah that's <laughs> I'm using a lot of stuffs so this job need time that is one <laughs> and it need patience so that you know you need your time to be here as you can see now I've, I have finished my first uh, uh, blending this one don't have onion um, those tomatoes uh, green and red peppers it does, doesn't have those things. So I'll keep on adding and adding until the last minute when we'll mix all of it together. And you can see it's moist so that it when you are adding another process, process, it don't get stuck to the breader. So as you can see, I'm putting a small amount of ginger and then also the other thing I haven't told you is that I also add my cooking oil. Like I'll use like six or seven 
spoons of uh, cooking oil but i'll keep on adding like one two in every process that i'm blending and also other thing guys <laughs> uh you expect to, the press to be messy but you can try to keep it as clean as you can keep on wiping wiping because oh i also being messy here <laughs> it's something you you know a uh, expect we are in the last uh, process of our uh, blending we have bled everything and now this is the last one you can see now I'll mix all of it together and then I'll start immediately I'll start the process of uh, putting the the you know the spices into the ice ice uh, ice box what are they called ice in ice icing cube pack yeah so <laughs> let's start get started I'll just you know take them out and put them in a uh, bags that are they have zip which you can zip and they are so good so and also let me tell you guys these spices I made here they will take me uh, like um, seven to eight months believe me seven to eight months because of how I made them uh, they are so tasty so you don't put a lot so i put two and also i mix uh with the other uh dry spices which also i shown you so when you mix them like that one and you use these two you are good to go and the food tastes so so yummy guys so yummy the time i knew how to make these uh, uh mm, spices i never go back guys Every time I'm almost to finish, I'm ready to do again and again. And you can try them out. And also, they are so good in digestion, I tell you. And I'm 100% guaranteed. They are so good. You know, these are natural things. And they don't have any uh, preservation chemicals or what. It's in just uh, green plants and that's it and vegetables and that's it and 
you will come to thank me later guys you can just give a try just buy small spices and plants dry them and then you will tell me the result so you can see here our our spice cubes are ready here now they are ready to be packed so guys thank you so so much for staying along until this end i do really appreciate you so much god bless you for being patient and if you haven't subscribed please join the family for more uh, videos like this and god will bless you and for my subscribers i don't take you for granted please you can share if you you are able to share please you can like and comment until next time <laughs>